All right, guys, in today's video, we're gonna do a little test. We're gonna see how quickly the KTM Super Duke R can go from 40 to 80. I think this is a pretty good functional test because, well, that's kind of a good passing speed that you might see on the highway. You need some, when you're getting on the highway or something to get in front of a car, you need to kind of have that passing speed. So we're gonna go down to 40 and we're gonna see how quickly we can get to 80. All right, here we go, we're about 40 and go. That felt pretty damn quick to me. Um, don't know what the time's gonna be. I'll drop that down below. Whew, that is brutal. Absolutely brutal. Yeah, that's where I think this bike really shines is that, that 40 pull. Um, it just, just pulls like a freight train. It does not wanna stop until you get to about, I don't know, 140-ish. Then the bike kinda starts to uh, have its naked limitations and gearing and the way the engine's set up. But wow, 40 to 80. <laughs> Let's try it again here in a little bit. If we can get this light to go green. Come on, light. Okay. All right. We're going to do another second gear. Let's get up to 40 miles an hour. And here we are. Wow. <laughs> this bike's so fast, I probably should have made this video 40 to 100. Golly. But that's not really realistic. I mean, that's for fun, but probably gonna get yourself in some trouble with the law doing stuff like that. Wow. Jeez Louise. <laughs> Hopefully we can get another stretch up here where we can try banging out another 40 to 80 and see how she performs. Alright, I can't tell what he's on. It's on uh, some Suzuki. Alright. I don't know if he's gonna pull ahead. Let's see what he does. There he goes. There he goes. Nice. Let's see if we can get another one of those 40 to 80s up here. Hopefully, police department is out there. Ooh, Tesla. I wonder how this would do off the line against Tesla. I feel like that'd be pretty good race, depending on the battery pack. All right, let's get up to 40 and then uh, drop the hammer. Let's make sure there's no police. All right, here we go, and go. Woo! That was into the wind also. It's moving. Moving, moving, moving. Awesome. Yeah, so I'll drop those times right there. Um, I don't know what a good 40 to 80 time is, to be honest. I don't think it's a super common measuring. Uh, <laughs> I don't think it's really common like measuring. Um, yeah, I don't think that's a really common measuring test, like 40 to 80, but I don't know. You guys can do with that information whatever you think. Tell me if you guys think that's fast or not down below. I don't know how fast a bike really should be 40 to 80 to be uh, really usable on the highway and stuff like that. This is definitely more than enough. Um, but 40 to 80, a lot of fun. One of my favorite pulls to do on this bike is second gear because that front wheel just comes up a little bit, you ride it out, and then you're at 80 in no time. So, so yeah, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video today on the Super Duke R. More videos to come, maybe a zero to 100 test in the future. I'm curious what this bike can do. So be on the lookout for that. Drop a like down below if you like this video. Really helps me out, helps me stay motivated to keep putting videos out on the Super Duke R. And yeah, guys, I'll catch you in the next one. See ya.